My name is Fervy2 and welcome back to Destiny 2 on the week 8 of Destiny 2 Season of the Witch. Now, as I noticed, as you guys noticed, that last week the final quest was already over. We've already seen uh, Savitha being resurrected only to get deaded again to have her power absorbed by Eris, completely turning her into the most powerful hive god only to banish Shivu from her throne world, making her essentially vulnerable. Yeah, it's a little recap to what I've learned. And of course, I have learned as of t yesterday that there are new things coming out in this week as well. For example, I went back on Destiny on Tuesday just to check on things. And of course, see this icon right here where the radio's at? Apparently, there's going to be a message on this one as well. So before... So before that, I wanted to say, check out Destiny if you want to try it out for yourselves. I don't have a link for it because I'm only playing this on Xbox on the PC. But if you do own Destiny on either Epic Games or even uh, Steam, you can try to check them out as well. So let's get started by listening to this message, and I'll tell you guys what's going to be happening or what's going to be going on in this video. This might be a short video, so... Look at how far we've come. I was always destined to become a queen. And you a knight. Just like that facile human game you like so much. And what game is that? Knights are so powerful there. Agile and unpredictable. Hmm. But there's only a thin line between the knights and the pawns. Is she on talking about chess? That's funny. As someone recently back from the dead, I sympathize. But before you move to retaliate, just check. What will it mean to be a knight after the game is ended? And that is a very good question on her part, you know? Because Civil Wrath is all of endless war and all fighting and endless violence, endless bloodshed, you know? Then. Eris gave her the ultimatum. She kicked her out of her own home, rendered her mortal, as I said before, and very vulnerable. And it's funny how Siva Roth's whole speech talks about their whole life as a game of chess. And Sivu favors the knight because the knight has plenty of moves to go around. But it just seems like like Savathun's talking to her like she doesn't have a strategy to win a war, other than just fight and fight and to no end. Of course, she speaks as one of the sides of the chess board is, this, is the witness. But who's on the other side, though? <clears throat> anyway, it is a very good analogy on Sivu, uh, Savathon, Savathun's part of Sivu's whole entire being. But, I think that might be just be the end of it here. But, I wanted to try to point things out of what this week is about. <clears throat> now I've checked on this whole Arcanas and minor Arcana cards here. I have one, two, three, and four left to get. And recently I have a friend who told me about what has been like what card is there? I may be missing some cards that I probably didn't get in Seventh Spire or I didn't get them at all. At the altars of summoning, which I found two over there. Now, I remember 
uh, what they said here. There's one new card at the altar of summoning, which would be the very last obey card. Or is it a minor? Or is it a major arcana? But what I've been told is that there is a new test in the Embaru engine. And I also found out that I haven't even finished the Embaru test. Turns out there's two tests in the Embaru engine. One that I painstakingly struggle to painstakingly struggle is the, the cunning. Let me go over to the Embaru engine real quick and we'll, and we'll talk about that. And I find that extremely funny. Now, you've been given a quest here called, or at least the Embaru engine. The mission objective is to part the mists. No idea what that means, but basically you have to complete both tests, I believe. Now, you all know what to do here is to find the odd one out, or at least the right symbol. I'm not going to do that yet, because I am trying to find the other door, which is right here. Now, I'm going to skip that real quick until I come to the door. It says, proceed through the Embaru engine. Now, I was intrigued by exploring the place here. And there are some places that you can't go through. Take a look at this. I only recently found out yet uh, last week that I never got through this. And funny story, I didn't record it, but I wish I would have. Otherwise, you would have seen my utter confusion. <clears throat> so I'm not gonna show you the part of the Embaru engine of the cunning test because it's gonna take way too long, and I don't probably remember where the location of the things are. Now, you're in the second floor of the bar engine. There's a portal back downstairs. Now, gift of a gift of navigation arcana required. Now, that's a thing I have not noticed yet. What is that? No idea. But, here we are in this other one that I did last week. This is called the Strength Test. Now, I was utterly confused by the objective. It says... It gets slow. Complete the strength test, strength proved. Now, I was conflu confused as to why these guys are here. They just show up. Watch this. I chose wrong. And look at that. There are... At least eight of those freaking little splinters, or I forgot what those are. Those things up there surrounding Eternal Executioner. I just like them. Now, if you guys haven't figured it out on last week, or you may have, but I'm going to give you guys a refresher here. So I noticed that there was a a, uh, a deep sight on Bailey right here. And I see footsteps right here, which leads me to this guy right here. that nothing happened nothing happened at all until he points out to another guy in which it increases the strength I have to find the correct uh, play because they all look like they're like chess pieces I have to pick the right hive of any kind to pretty much essentially move on and increase my strength here. Increase the meter. And it will get harder because you will have to figure it out how in the hell you're going to do this. So I may not remember. I forgot how it goes. I'm not sure if it was this guy here. Yeah. And if it says your march or march continues, that means, oh yeah, I got, I got free moves here. And... It confused me because I thought I was pointing that right here, and I died. So it, it, it's like a different thing. You gotta figure out where the hell these knights are at. Which knights or thralls is the right one. It takes... How do I say this forever? I think it was right here. And I think it was this one? Okay. And of course the room confuses you to some point because 
You think this was pointing to the guy right here? No, it ain't. Maybe. And of course, I've done a lot of testing to see which is which. Which uh, high is the right one? Look at that. There you go. I have conjured war. That is pretty much what you do here. You've already seen my walkthrough of the cunning test. It's gonna take me longer, so I'm gonna end my recording here for now until we get to the navigation test. If you want to know what the navigation test is, you know, I have to wait a few minutes, and it's gonna be skipping. So, oh well. So I believe what my friend told me. Is that the location is straight up behind me and hopefully nobody nabbed it the location of the secret card is closer to Savathun as we speak and right up here next to Savathun's uh, statue if I get up there yes I got it yes there we go that is the last R minor arcana Ooh. Okay, and I've already got the card, so it's time for me to head on back. Yeah. Alright, here we are back at the Artrayum our our to look at the divination, to the table, the lectern of divination, and look at this. The last card right here, the gift of navigation. An incantation to unveil the final test in the Embora engine. Right. So, now that's three, that's one down, and I probably got one, two. Three more cars to go, and I really want to find all the major arcanas. So, let's not waste any time and head to the Embargo Engine. Anyway, here I am. I just finished all the other debug tests that I need to get to, and with the card I needed, I can proceed to the Embargo Engine to see this thing. The Navigation Test, I believe it's called. Alright. On to the last one, I think. Also, I figured that I'd need this weapon in hand to... Because why not? Well, I've been told by a friend. A good old friend of mine. And what the hell? Oh, yeah, it's one of those windows. Okay, so let's see. Not sure what that leads to. There's a portal right here. Oh, doors and doors. Okay, let's take up here and begin the test. I'm not sure if any of these tests are... are... Another obfuscation. Guardian, overcome this puzzle as you have the others. Okay, we have a door with three different elements. A void, arc, and void, and there are one, two, three, six doors. Wait, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven doors, or, or something. Eight, I think. Not sure. We're looking for Ark. Ark, I think. Honestly, I'm gonna... I'm not sure we're looking for Ark, but I'm gonna test if what happens if I get this wrong. I'm not sure. I think I'm getting this wrong. I'm not sure why. Let me see. Uh, you have explored and acquired. Ah. I have no idea, to be honest. So, I'll be thinking, what the hell am I going to do here? So, let's look around here. So I noticed that that has an arc door right behind me. So it looks like a left side, so let's see. Hmm. Should I go here? Yeah, I unintentionally got this one right. That room disappeared, I think. Alright, so we're going with fire fire 
And it looks like it's going to be through the middle, I think. Not sure if it's going to be in the one in front of me or the one to my to the right in the front. So let's think here. It's on top. It's going to be the one right here. It's not going to be in the front. It's got to be on the top. There we go. And oh my gosh. <laughs> This room is utterly confusing, so let's see. Uh, void, and it looks like the room to the right. So let's see, there's none here, and... Oh, it looks like these runes are getting shifty as we speak, so... Hmm. Of course, they're gonna make it hard for me to try and get in a right angle. Let's see. There we go. Alright. Alright, so I think I got the gist of this little puzzle here. Apparently the door behind me will reveal what needs to be opened. So I'm looking for a fire rune to the right. Oh dear. Son of a bitch. Alright. This is gonna be difficult. Hmm. To the right door, and someone's calling me. Hold on. Okay. So I'm trying to figure out what the hell am I doing here. Here. Uh, sorry, I got interrupted by somebody. Tell me to need to clean up the some garage, but I'm afraid I might have to anyway. So let's see what I need to do here. That one's all mixed up here. Could it be here? that that's a puzzle solved King. and that's all there is to it in this week's destiny 2 a message from Sabathun taunting her sister about chess analogies and her current predicament a new dialogues shown up in both Sabathun's Spire Throne World and possibly Altus and Summoning you know how everyone gets chatty with Imaru, Eris, and Ikora. It's all gonna be from Sabathun from now on. Which, I'm glad that she's back. But I still want to see what Siva Wrath looks like. Can I still bow down to my war-mongering hive goddess? Who knows. But still, I don't know. So, until the end of the season, the epilogue, the final epilogue, and of course, the newest season whenever it comes out. So, before I end the video here, let's take a quick little, quick little look at the challenges. So, we have kinetic forces, I'm going to start from the bottom this time, final blows with kinetic weapons, any type of kinetic weapons, bosses from strikes and vanguard, how many can you complete, guardians, Defeating Guardians in Mayhem with Supers. Well, I'm enjoying the Mayhem, Ben. Melee Final Blows in Ritual Playlist. Not sure what it is. Probably anything, really. Bows or Handgun Cannons. Uh, defeat pe people with Strand Arc and Solar Super Abilities. Or Supers. The last one is Generate Orbs of Power and Find Any Hidden Chest in Southern Spire. And that's all I'm going to read about it. So, thank you all for watching this video. And I hope you enjoyed the video and this episode of Destiny 2 Season of the Witch. And if you did enjoy it, please click the like or dislike button. Any thoughts about the current season and how hard... Again, how difficult was it for you guys to try to complete this navigation test in the, C in the Ibaro engine or the Shrink test? I find it difficult. Hmm. <clears throat> I'll go ahead and comment section down below. And of course, if you want to check out my YouTube channel for more of my content, go ahead and check that out. And if you enjoy my content, please do not hesitate to click the subscribe button to support that channel and click on the notification bell whenever I upload a new video. I work on these videos for a weekend, maybe. Or they make a video about two videos a week. Or three videos a week. 
Just to let you know, because I got exhausted, and I just tend to sleep throughout the day. So, again, thank you all for watching. I hope to see you guys in the new season of Destiny 2. Bye-bye, and have a wonderful day.